if y'all don't know, Little Caesars got these little tin bites or something. I just ordered them online. I'm gonna go in here and get it, y'all. This line is long, so I hope they got my order ready because I ordered it maybe. I ain't gonna lie, I ordered it about 20 minutes ago. They said it was gonna be done at 12.05. It's 12.11. So, yeah, I just calmed down my hair and um, I just put on some little clothes because y'all know I wasn't dressed. So, let me go. I'm gonna go in here. Okay, y'all, I I see why it usually, I don't go to this um, Little Caesars. It literally took me 20 minutes, but I got a cherry Pepsi because it came with my food. I don't know why, but whatever. Um, I got these little um the pepperoni crazy puffs yeah i want to show y'all them before they get cold but this is how they look y'all this look like some bullshit me want to follow the hype me want to follow the fucking hype it look like some bullshit because they burnt mine but and then i also got some crazy bread now this look good that other shit i don't know I'm, I'm about to show y'all again how this shit looks. I don't know. But y'all, in my box, y'all, I'm, I'm going to test it out when we get home. So I'll, I'll talk back to y'all in a minute. Okay, y'all. So I just got home. And here is the food again. So we're going to try the, um, the little puffers. What are they called? I'm going to tell y'all what they called. They're called the pepperoni crazy puffs. Now, y'all, I don't really even like pepperoni. I'm more of a sausage type of girly. So, this is how it looks. This is the bottom of it. Y'all see that right there? They kind of burnt mine. So, and they just put the butter sauce. Y'all, this is a sucky um location. So, this is the inside of it. The inside, it feels kind of soft. The outside is a little bit of crunchy. It's decent. See, me personally, that's too hard for me. It tastes kind of burnt. I wish they would have put the garlic sauce everywhere. Put a little bit more marinara sauce. But they decent. Next, we got the, these are the garlic, I mean, these are the garlic sticks. Now, y'all, these are my favorite. These are how these look. They don't have any marinara sauce on it. These are just like cheesy garlic bread. Y'all, these are so good. They're so, so good. This good. I already knew this was going to be good. They used to have this in a pizza form. Wow, they still do. It's a deep dish pizza. From Little Caesars. It's so good. Sausage, so good. So this remind me of this. So, they got a little review on that. It's decent. <laughs> I decided that I'm going to do a little rating. 10 out of 10. No. I'll give it a like a uh, 5.2, not even a 5.5, 5.2 for the little puff things. They decent. These right here, I give a 10 out of 10 because those are great. But the other things, they they are right. I feel like maybe, maybe if they was in sausage and they like that location took the time to create their stuff right, it would have been better. God, you call me by my name The love you give me, I just can't deny No longer blinded, I can feel I'm on my way to meet you 
at the top, you know All these trials and tribulations got me tired, I need rest And I heard that I can't come to you when weary of my flesh You awaken me from death, God I need you No more walking by the flesh, that's when I leave you God told me I'm someone, told me I'm someone Told me I'm someone, told me I'm, told me I'm Told me I'm someone, told me I'm someone Hey y'all, welcome to the channel. It's me, Brittany, mother of seven. Welcome back to Brittany Plus Seven. In today's video, y'all, we are gonna run some errands. It is like 8, 16 in the morning. I just dropped the kids off at daycare. Um, it is the second day of spring break, and baby, they've been breaking me to spring. <laughs> they done broke me into the spring. Y'all, um, we also have to run some errands and stuff today. But... Yeah, but we're not gonna run our errands until after my appointment. I have an 11 o'clock appointment. Yeah, I have an 11 o'clock appointment. And then I also need to, y'all, I'm looking, I'm currently looking for some papers that I needed for, um, I need to do my food share renewal. I need to drop it off, but right now we finna go head over into menards because i need to get a broom y'all i am gonna finally soak these nails off we're gonna go to mcdonald's and grab something to eat my appointment is at 10 o'clock so we have a couple hours so we're gonna soak these nails off i'm not doing nothing to my hair until later so i'm gonna try to fix my ponytail or put a you know look decent at least going into the appointment so yeah let's go in here to menards Okay, y'all, I just came out of there for a broom and dustpan. It was $15.61, but y'all, <clears throat> my other broom that I had, I had got it from here. It lasted me a whole year. These are like the industrial brooms, and y'all know, I like a big broom, a good big broom to get everything up because we sweep a lot. We do have a vacuum but we also sweep a lot so <clears throat> i showed y'all the comparisons between the two brooms the broom was 10.98 the green broom that i showed y'all it was 12 11.98 or 12.98 and then the dustpan i just went ahead and bought a dustpan because i'm usually just buying my dustpans out of um y'all dollar tree and I noticed when I had that dustpan, it lasted a lot longer. So, I just went ahead and bought the dustpan out of here. It was $4, $3.98. So, both was $15. That's not bad. Sometimes you ought to pay for better quality of stuff so you don't got to keep rebuying it. And that's what I just have to do. So, we're going to be careful with this broom because the other broom, we had it for a while. And it just, <clears throat> y'all, if y'all would have seen it, it was, it was giving out. So, y'all, we finna run over to McDonald's and grab something to eat. So, I'll talk to y'all in a little while. Okay, y'all, I got a coffee, a Sprite, my food, and my broom. Okay, y'all, let me show y'all what I do. I always order me a drink with no ice in it because I got an ice machine at home. And here go my Stanley Cup right here. Y'all, I had to make sure my Sprite was not diluted because sometimes it be diluted. Y'all, I pour it over in my Stanley Cup and I have it all day. 
literally all day. That is a little hack because you know the ice adds, you don't get as much. So I got a full cup. And I believe this is a. I'm trying to tell y'all what ounce this one is. Okay, this one is a 40 ounce. So this is a 40 ounce cup. This was the Valentine edition one that they was going crazy over y'all. But that's neither here nor there. Y'all, I ended up finding my review. And then I also found a couple bills that I have to pay. Who I have to schedule to pay. Um, I don't know if I told y'all that I had got a ticket um, a few months ago. He couldn't ticket me for nothing else, y'all. I wasn't speeding. Um, I wasn't disobeying the law. Only thing was that they couldn't see my um, my temporary tag in my car. And my temporary tag is still valid. They couldn't see it, so they did it. He was kind of like an asshole cop, so he gave me a... Um, a ten dollar um ticket for not wearing my seatbelt so i have to pay that by may 8th and then i have another bill that's due that i have to pay nine dollars for y'all i'm on a payment plan for something and i honestly if i didn't go looking for my review to fill out i would have forgot about the little nine dollars Compared to them taking um, money out of bank accounts and stuff. It's like a payment plan that I set up. So, I'm happy I actually went and looked for that. So, I got my hot cake. I got a hot cake and sausage platter. I just put my, um, my pancakes. I mean, my syrup in the microwave for a couple seconds just to get it warm, y'all. I'm going to go upstairs because I have to fill out this review. And, yeah. So, I'll talk back to y'all when I start soaking off these nails. Open up the mess, drop it in the water, let the daughter find an image with the rest. She'll be learning how to breathe. Spinning through identity, reveal another pretty little scheme. Save her mind. Hold her hand. And don't believe a lie. You understand me. Walk her down the valley. Pack a piece of heaven for the bottoms of her feet Teach her how to jump and how to stretch when she reach Like the angels do And you gon' make it through now Tell about the healer Greater is the one within and call him as the leader Teach her how to hold a pretty hand up to the sky And I'ma wait up on the giver He'll deliver like a dealer to take her Every door and how the windows let the sun in copy out the key and okay y'all so i didn't know it was getting so late but i am almost running late to my appointment y'all yeah, my appointment is at 10 o'clock it's like 9 53 but luckily it's like four minutes away i didn't even get to do nothing to my hair y'all i don't even care i don't care i'm gonna just go in here any kind of way I look decent, I think. Y'all, this is what I got on. Bad hair day hat, because it is a bad hair day. A jacket, some jogger pants, and some Uggs. And I'm wearing my little lemon bag. And y'all. Okay, y'all. So, I am in the car. Y'all. Okay, y'all. It is 9.55. I gotta be, my appointment is at 10 o'clock, y'all. It's literally up the street from my house. So, yeah. I know I'm gonna be a couple minutes late, but it is what it is, y'all. I thought I was gonna be able to take off all my nails. I wasn't. Um, my thumbs are still home. My thumbs are still on and one extra finger but i deal with it when i get home 
y'all. I gotta go get the boys a lamp for their room because I don't know if they need lights or lamps. So I'm gonna go to the Google and I'm gonna buy a light and I'm gonna buy light bulbs. Cause I don't know if their room, if their light in their room is savageable. So I'll talk to y'all when I get out my appointment, y'all. Why did I leave my keys in the car? Y'all, I left my keys in the car. I was just in there searching for my keys. I was just in there searching for my keys and they right here on the floor of my car. Y'all, I'm using um my if y'all haven't noticed, my lips has been um, I don't know, peeling really bad lately. So I had went and got me some generic a and d ointment for them so hopefully this works it looks like it has been it looks like it has been though because my lips were really really bad y'all sometimes i just go through the peeling stage of my lips all over again mm, i got my stanley cup in the car with me it's still the same stuff in there from earlier and it's still full Y'all, it's so cold and so good. So, I have to go over to the gas station. And I have to go to the Goodwill. Y'all, I am not feeling well. I, I'm not going to lie to y'all. I am not feeling well today. I have chills down my body. I don't know if I'm coming down with something. I have like a um, a sore throat. I am cold as ever, y'all. I am freezing cold. And I have a slight headache. So I don't know what I'm coming down with. But if y'all don't know, your girl gets sick easily. So I don't know. I just started my car, y'all. We finna go head over to the Goodwill. See if I can find them a, um, a light. And I'm gonna stop at the um, I'm gonna also stop at um, Dollar Tree and I'm gonna see if they got some generic, um, not some generic, but I'm gonna see if they got some um, lights on. I think I might have some left because I probably need to just disinfect my house really, really good. So, yeah. I know this video is like, girl, but y'all, this is what I be going, this is what I do in a day. Uh, I want an Instacart so bad, but I think I got sick yesterday because, y'all, I was Instacarting when it was raining yesterday, so I made pretty good yesterday. That's why I'm not like really, really adamant on going. Um, yesterday was Monday, so I did pretty good with Instacarting, but I was Instacarting in the rain, y'all. So I think that's how I'm sick. But yeah, um, what else? Oh, the boys are at home. I'm going to see if I can order them a pizza or something. Something minor for them to eat for lunch so they won't be tearing up my kitchen. So I'll talk back to y'all in a little while. So I make sure I put on my robe and everything. I'm under my covers. Y'all, I am on the computer. About to get ready to edit. So... Yeah, I'll talk to y'all a little later when I'm doing something. Because it's really a lazy day for me. So, I'll talk back to y'all when I get ready and do something. Hey, y'all. Um, It is the next day from when I was filming. Y'all, the nails did come off. I got every nail off now. Y'all, yesterday I did not finish the vlog. Y'all, I was, I, I, I'm i still not feeling well. I was not feeling well yesterday. Um, I'm still not feeling well, but today, um, I want to go to, um, they having a job fair today. It starts at 11 o'clock. It is around 9.30 in the morning. It's like 9.30 in the morning. So, I'm going to go to that today. Y'all, I am getting my hair ready. I know y'all haven't seen my real hair in a while. I've been having it. 
I've been having weave in and the only reason why I don't want to put the weave back in today is because if I knew I had to sit down and put the weave in, I was not going to make it to the, um, to the, um, the, op the, um, the job there. So I just decided to just go ahead and flat iron my hair out. Y'all see all my little pricklies up there? I decided to go ahead and just flat iron my hair out, y'all, and just... And just wear my hair. I think I'm probably going to wear my hair for a couple of days. Because I need to wash out my hair bundles. And get them all back conditioned. And revamp my hair. And then I'm going to put it back in. Because y'all know I don't really like my real hair being out. Because I sweat really really bad in my scalp. And my hair frizzes up really really fast. So yeah. I have already started doing my hair. So I'm pretty much done. I do use... For oil, I use oil sheen, and then I use, um, cause, oh, my nails, y'all. I'm gonna put on some press songs. I don't know if I'm gonna put them on for the interviews or after. I don't know, y'all. So, I just use kaleidoscope drops. And, at the top of my hair, it is kind of looser. Y'all, here are my edges. Y'all know I am very transparent with y'all now because I really don't care. So here are my edges. They are growing back a lot because this right here was all empty. So now it is starting to grow back a lot because I have been using Kaleidoscope. So I just drop it in the middle and I just rub it in. Rub it in really, really good. And then also for my edge control, I use the... Oh, I use the Miracle Drop Edge Control. It's in my room. I be have to hide it from Journey. I'm almost all out of that. I'm actually almost all out of this as well. So, I'm going to have to re-up on both of them and the shampoo. Y'all know what? It's so crazy. So, the shampoo, the conditioner, the Miracle Drops, and the, um... And the edge control lasted all around the same amount of time, which is great. So, it's like, it was like a month and a half. And remind y'all, I used the, the shampoo and conditioner on Journey and Justice hair as well. So, um, I am going to slick my edges down, but I'm not going to do it right this second. Because, y'all know when y'all first wrap y'all hair up, y'all don't, I'm finna wrap my hair back up. I don't want it to be greasy. I don't want my wrap to be like super greasy because I don't mind the drops in my hair but I don't want the edge control in my hair right away so I'm gonna do it after do I see some type of hair growth now a lot of people been asking me like tell me how it work tell me how it work I don't feel like it has not my hair is growing it's getting thicker I'm gonna say that my hair is getting thicker and I do feel like my hair is getting longer, but it's just getting so much thick, thicker and so much healthier. Because I can say like four to six weeks ago, my hair wasn't this full. I always had thick hair, but my hair started falling out because of... I'm not going to lie to y'all. I used this shampoo like three times and this shit broke my hair out. This right here broke my hair out. And also, this right here broke my hair out. So, this is the conditioner, but I had the shampoo. So, it's the Seamoss Blend. This by Mayel. It broke my hair out. So bad, y'all. Don't use that. If y'all trying to grow y'all hair, do not use the Mayel products. The Mayel products that I used to use, they used to do really, really good. But I don't know if they changed the formula because another company bought their formula. I mean, bought their, bought their products. So, I don't know. But, it, it did my hair sucky. So, the only reason why I'm still, I still have those hair products because I use them on my hair bundles. <laughs> they do pretty good on my hair bundles because, you know, of course, that's not human hair. I mean, well, it is human hair, but it's not my hair out my scalp. So, um, the Myel Seamoss, it made my scalp very, very itchy and I had very, very bad sores in my hair. Um... This Chai Carrington Chi, yeah, Chi, 
Um, this made my hair very, very dry. It made my hair very dry. And I already saw, suffer from very, very dry scalp because I have eczema. So, you know, I don't like it. But I have realized with the kaleidoscope, it feeds back into my hair a lot. And it gives my hair like a lot of natural oils. Because if you see like now, let's see. Oh, uh, y'all ain't going to be able to see. But, like now, I only put the um, grease around my edges and a little bit right here just because this is a spot in my hair where my hair, it, it, it takes a lot to grow because I used to have braided ponytails. So, yeah. Like all the, pon all the braids and stuff, it pulled out right there for some reason. So, yeah, here go my hair. Y'all, it's not the best that I can do, but it's decent. Y'all, I gotta go finish up this resume so I can go. I gotta. The thing is at eleven o'clock. The um the interview is at eleven, but I want to get there like ten thirty, just so I can go into the computer lab and um and print out my and print out my resumes and put them in a folder because you know you don't want to go in there and not have your resume ready so i'm gonna do it at home and just print it out there i could print it out here y'all i just don't feel like dealing with my printer <laughs> truth be told i do have a printer i just don't feel like dealing with it it be on some other stuff sometimes so i'm just gonna wrap up my hair and then i'll talk to y'all when i get done getting dressed Okay, y'all, so I am doing a resume on this internet site because my resume looked it so shoddy, y'all. I had to redo it. And I'm just eating some leftover Chinese food and I got uh, some Sprite in here that I just poured. So yeah, we gonna finish this up really fast. Okay, y'all, this is the perfume I'm wearing today. It's Miss Dior. It's one of my favorites. So Miss Dior. Just a sweater, long sleeve sweater, just a sweater and some nice black jeans and some Ugg boots. So, yeah, y'all don't feel like hooking up the, um, y'all, I really don't even feel like plugging the light back up because I got to hurry up and leave out so I can go print my resume, y'all. So I'll talk to y'all in a little while. Okay, y'all, we are in the car, y'all. My face is so greasy. Ugh, my face is so greasy. It's all right. I'd rather be greasy than ashy. Y'all, so I didn't even tell y'all my heat has been out for the last two days or day and a half, like two days. And it's been very, very cold. So it's been very, very cold in my house. And I believe that's how I got sick. Y'all, how come my landlord came and my thermostat was out? So he just replaced my thermostat. But I'm still making it on time to my interview literally the interview is like 10 minutes away from my house but luckily um my baby daddy was getting ready to pull up so he can be there with my landlord or his maintenance people thank god because i did not want to miss this just because of that but i know i need that because y'all my breathing has been terrible when i say terrible terrible the weather changes. Before I even walk in here, I'm going to have to give myself some albuterol inhaler, y'all. I'm just... You know, I told y'all I was sick yesterday, so my breathing has been acting up. That's why I hate being sick. So, yeah. I'm so nervous, y'all. I am so nervous. I'm nervous. I always get nervous like this. Always. I got a, um, I brought my tote bag with me because I got an envelope, an envelope. I have a, um, folder that I'm going to put my resumes in so I can look a little bit presentable. I don't even think y'all could see my whole outfit because I didn't feel like plugging the light up because he was walking in and, you know, I didn't want... I, I don't want my landlord to be doing what I do. Know that I film and stuff. That ain't that ain't cool. So 
when I get back home, I'll show you my outfit, y'all. Like I said, I don't really got nothing too major on. I just got on a, I literally got on a black sweater, some black skinny jeans, no holes, no rips, just some nice jeans, but they're skinny, so they look kind of like dress pants and some Ugg boots. I got on some brown Ugg boots. I feel like that's good for a interview. I feel like that. I had um, some gray dress pants, but then I realized that I didn't have no like no dress shoes, so it was pointless. I was just like, I'm just gonna come like this. I've worn this to other interviews and got the job. This exact sweater, I think this is my interview sweater, y'all. I ain't gonna lie to y'all. Everybody got like different things that they like as far as interview wise. I feel like this is my interview sweater, you know, because um people like i got one interview outfit and i feel like i always wear this to my interview i don't care what nobody say i feel like i do so y'all let me go in here i'll talk to y'all when i come out but y'all before we go in i'm gonna take some albuterol inhaler i put a little bit of vaseline on my lips. I need not to be adding no more Vaseline. And I got my little Sprite. I'm ready, y'all. I look okay. Face look okay. Hair okay. I'm in a good mood. Okay, y'all, so I just got out of there. Um, I think it went pretty good. So, come to find out, it was an open interview. It was like open interviews, and it was a job fair. So, I went to, it's like an hour later. I went to a few other um, jobs that they had at certain tables, y'all. That took everything out of me. Y'all know I don't feel good. So, my body is just... Baby, my body wore the fuck down. My body wore down. But I'm happy I still went. So the job that wanted me to come and have an interview with them. Um, I think I pretty much got it. They asked what position I wanted to um, work. I told them third shift. She asked, can I work second? I told her, possibly. I told her I could, just because at this point, I just need a job, so, yeah. <laughs> Y'all, going in there, the little strength that I did have, baby, I ain't got it no more. When I, I don't know what bug I caught, but baby... Give it to somebody else. It was a lot of other jobs there. So it was like nine other jobs there on top of that job. So it was like 10 jobs in total. And they was actively looking for employment. So I went to a lot of different tables. I'm going to apply for three, three jobs online because it's pretty much online. So, it's like three jobs that I'm going to apply for when I get home on the computer. I could have applied in their computer lab because it's like a job, a job place, a job center. I could have applied while I was there. But, y'all, I got a cough. I was like holding my cough back while I was talking to the lady. It worked. That's why I was like, let me take some inhaler, you know, so my cough wouldn't be coming out. But I noticed, like, as I was talking to the other people, like... You know, I was <clears throat> like trying not to cough, but y'all, this bug got me toe down. So I'm about to go back home, <laughs> take off these clothes, and get in the bed. Or I, I'm not like super, super exhausted. My body is just like I'm getting my chills and stuff back. That's the thing, like, earlier, I wasn't having, like, the chills, like, so much, 
but now I'm getting my chills back. And that's the only thing that I was really concerned about is my chills. And now they're coming back, so my body is aching. I don't know. Um, I'm, I took a COVID test. Or I don't even know if you could say that. I took a C-word test. Um, it's negative. So, I don't know what's going on. I think I'm just sick. And no, I am not with child. I'm not pregnant. So, that's not even an option. So, I don't know, y'all. So, I'll talk back to y'all in a little while. Yeah, you can bring that, y'all. I just got home. I just got home, and y'all, it is so warm in my house. Y'all know I was just saying I had the chills, so I'm so happy that <coughs> my heat is working. Um, It should be on my bed. So, no, it's down here. Bring my cover down, though. Y'all, so I'm really, really excited about that. So, this is the little sweater I had on. And just some nice, it's just a little sweater. Took off my shoes and some skinny jeans. Y'all, I hope I got the job. I hope I got the job, but we will see. I'm gonna sit down here, get on the computer, fill out a couple of applications, and yeah, lay around because I do not feel well.